Hi guys, welcome to this video. My name is Tyler and today we're going to be going over A-level biology calibrating microscopes. So, let's say we have a microscope and we're doing a practical. First, you want to look through the eyepiece lens. These are the lenses right at the top of the microscope. There's normally two of them. You will see something that looks like a ruler. This is called the eyepiece graticule. This is a very small scale that is located within the eyepiece lens of your microscope. It doesn't have actual units. These are known as arbitrary units. Don't get confused with arbitrary units. It basically means there are no units on this ruler. Another piece of equipment you need to calibrate a microscope would be a stage micrometer. The stage micrometer is a slide which has a very small scale marked onto it. The scale is exactly one millimeter in length and has a hundred divisions. The stage micrometer does have units. It is placed on the stage of the microscope. The stage is here. The stage micrometer, as said, has a length of one millimeter and a hundred divisions, which equal that one millimeter. This means one division is 0 0.01 millimeters or 10 micrometers. To get from millimeters to micrometers, you times by a thousand. When you focus using your microscope, you'll be able to see both the eyepiece graticule and the micrometer. By adjusting your slide, you'll be able to adjust the micrometer so that it aligns perfectly with the eyepiece graticule. Here we can see the eyepiece graticule is the one above and the micrometer is the one below. To carry out the calibration successfully, the left sides of both the micrometer and the eyepiece graticule must be in line with each other. We then have to find a point where two of the hash marks on both the rulers line up. The hash marks are just the lines that make up the rulers. At a point where they both line up, there are 50 divisions on the stage micrometer and 87 divisions on the eyepiece graticule. Now we've shrunk it down so we have a bit more room so we can do some maths. So now we know 50 micrometer divisions is equal to 87 graticule divisions. And as a micrometer adds up to one millimeter in length, and this is half of the micrometer, we know 0.5 millimeters is 87 divisions on the graticule. So now we divide 0.5 millimeters by 87, and this is 0.00575 millimeters to three significant figures. So one division on the eyepiece graticule is equal to 0.00575 millimeters. This number is a bit messy to play with. So we're going to times it by a thousand to get it into micrometers, which is 5.75 micrometers. You now remove the stage micrometer from the stage as you have now successfully calibrated your microscope. You can now measure the length of a specimen being studied using the eyepiece graticule. Here we now have an example to study, which is a cell. We know from our calculation before that each division on the eyepiece graticule is 5.75 micrometers. As you can see, the cell has a length of 15 divisions in total. So you multiply 5.75 micrometers by 15 to get 86.25 micrometers. Now this is the actual length of the cell. Remember, you must recalibrate when, one, when you change the magnification, or two, when you use a new microscope. Now that's it for the contents of this video. I really hope you found it useful. If you did, make sure to like the video and subscribe so that you can see more of our content. Make sure to check out our channel because you never know, we might post some content about your other A-level subjects and we might be able to help you. Thanks for watching. Bye-bye.